guys welcome back to my channel today I have another haul for you guys and I bought a few of these things a really really long time ago uh, maybe two weeks ago um, I don't even remember anymore but I do have some stuff that I purchased recently so I guess I'll just start with what I purchased a while back and I did go to Hobby Lobby and I did find a few things on clearance so I'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys what I found so I found this super cute locker pencil holder and it, it has like the magnets in the back uh, it was $149 and I just thought it was a good deal and I plan on using this for my fridge hopefully the magnets work on my fridge and uh, let me just open it to see it more um, closely because I haven't even opened it yet um, and I did get this a while back so yeah I just want I just wanted to see how um, let me see yeah it's, yeah I think it will work yep perfect for what I need it for so the second thing that I picked up at Hobby Lobby was this super adorable magnetic locker clock for 99 cents I just thought it was super cute it's uh, it's white with pink um, stripes and then it also has some gold um, now moving on to the planner planner related items so I picked up these um, what is this washi tape tube and th they had a bunch of different ones they were $4.99 each but I just didn't like the other ones um, at least not to where I thought that I needed to have it um, <coughs> I really really like this one though this one has a bunch of girly let me see if I can focus that a bunch of girly girl washes washes washi rolls oh my god I cannot talk today I'm sorry I'm just so tired um so I really like this one right here the pink with like I don't know it's just like I can't even explain it but you'll see what I'm talking about it's right here I love that one and then I also really like this one with the bows so adorable and then the other one with the eyelashes so cute I love that um, and then I really really like this one with the well um, with the heart it's like a rose gold with the heart and then I love this one and it's just like a floral one so cute and then this one down here is my favorite I think it's just a really thick <coughs> washes tape with a bunch of little dolls on in it so yeah I thought that was very very cute and the last thing that I picked up from Hobby Lobby was this book right here and this was not on clearance this was not on sale this was a regular price um, I can't remember if I used a 40% off coupon or if it was already on 40% off when I got it but I did pay I think like twelve dollars for it um, but yeah uh, this is just the simply lovely sticker book and I just really loved the theme the baby pink with the black and like the pastel colors I just thought it was very very cute and let me just show you this right here OMG my favorite part I guess this is why I picked it up for the beautiful flowers I just I'm obsessed they kind of look like vintage um, flowers so I just love that so much and it, <coughs> it does have some large lettering quotes or quotes I don't know how to say it um, so yeah now I'm going to show you what I picked up at Dollar Tree, which is basically two different things. Not very exciting, I know. <coughs> but I'll still show you anyway. And again, this was a really long time ago. This wasn't recently. So I got this little, what is this? The Elf, 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 I cannot say it. Oh my god. I cannot talk. Elf, Elf Tower or something like that. I'm sorry, I you know what I'm talking about. The Paris Tower or whatever. 
um, a buck, why not, right? So cute to just as decoration. I kind of want to go for, I kind of want to redo my whole desk area and do a gold and black theme with a little bit of pink, baby pink, like a pastel pink. So I'm trying to find things that are either, either gold, or black, or pink that will match my whole, like, you know, desk area. So this is one of the things that I picked up for that. Um, and I don't know if I bought this, like this is stripped from the very point or whatever it's called at the very top. <coughs> I don't remember if I got it like that or if it tripped it trip on the way home. I think it tripped on the way home because yeah, at the store I would have noticed it. Um, but I didn't notice it until I was home and I was like getting it out of the bag and I said, what the heck happened? Um, so yeah, I don't know if I just missed that at the store and got it like that or if it tripped on the way home. But it doesn't really bother me. I mean, it's just a little trip at the very top. I don't... You can't really see it unless you really, really look at it. <coughs> so, it's just going to be for decoration anyways. So, I got that. And then the other thing that I got at do the dollar store, the dollar tree, was more of these containers, plastic containers with... Or, stackable organizing drawers. It's just a little drawer... Um, and it's for like a single, they only sell like singles like that. I wish they sold like at least two of them together like that. Um, but whatever, I mean for a dollar, why not? Um, and I got three of them. I already have nine of them. So this will make nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So now I will have twelve. And <coughs> the way I have my other ones set up is just... I glued them together so they don't like move around or anything. I just glued them like that and that is how I have them and now I have three more. This is right here. Oh my god you guys. I went a little crazy. But I saved a lot in these books. So I got these from Walmart. Yes, from Walmart for three dollars each oh my god i know they are not the new books obviously um they are older books but still really really good books so i'm obsessed with the planner basics so i definitely had to pick that one up i got two of those just because i love this planner this i think this is like my favorite book from the happy planner <coughs> from all the ones they have made i think this is the one my probably my favorite one so yeah, I already have like the original one, like the first one I ever bought for the Planner Basics. And then I have a backup that I found for like four ninety nine at Hobby Lobby. And now I have two more backups. So now I have one, two, three. Now I have four books of this book. Like, oh my god. So yeah, I had to go to my other Walmart because it's bigger and they have more everything. So I went to their clearance section and to my surprise, I found <coughs> a bunch, a bunch of these books there like this is not even all of them like basically they have like maybe 30 books maybe 30 30 35 books and um <coughs> i noticed that they were in the clearance section but they did not have a price on them they were just all sitting there and i said hmm i wonder how much these are so i went i took all of them <laughs> literally i took all of them because i thought they were going to be like super cheap and that i was just going to get all of them so, I took all of them and I went to the, you know those little computer things that are everywhere in Walmart, randomly places, that they, you can check the price of an item if you don't know the price. Well, I went to one of those and I started scanning all of them and they all were not on sale. They were all $19.99 or I don't know how much they are at Walmart, but they were not on sale. And I said, what the heck? And then why are they on the clearance section? And I still thought, I still kind of wanted to scan everything, everything, I scanned everything, and then I got to this one right here, the colorful boxes, <coughs> I think it was this one, yeah, I think it was this one, I went to it, and I scanned it, and bam, <laughs> bam, it was only $3, and I said, what the heck, 
only this one is in clearance why is everything else there in the same clearance section then? so what I did was I took all the sticker books that I wanted to buy like all the different books that I wanted um, to see if they would let me keep all of them for the same price as this one so I took two of my favorite books which I, now that I think about it I sh probably should have taken another one just because I love it so much and then I also took one of the oh my god I'm sorry guys those were my dogs they were barking at my cat outside they are looking out here through the window and they are barking but anyways I picked up this watercolor book because I just for no reason at all honestly I just wanted it I already have it and I think I have a backup for it as well I don't remember but come on three dollars why not and then I got the wellness book I do not have this one I never bought it and just because it has some stickers in here that I know I'm never gonna use but like all these I don't think I'm ever gonna use them but then it does have a bunch that I will use like for these like this one's right here um, or these um, so yeah uh, for three dollars why not right so I got that one and then I also got the fitness which I never had I never would have bought in it if it was not on clearance for three dollars um, I will use some of these stickers, but then again, it has a bunch of stickers that I would never use. Um, so, I don't know what I'm going to have to do with the rest. Um, but yeah, and then I also got the mini, I mean the fitness, but in the mini section. Mini section. In the mini size. Oh my god, I cannot talk. Um, <coughs> so yeah, I just like the minis because they are so cute and tiny compared to the original big regular stickers but now that I think about it I don't know if I'm going to be using a lot of these mini stickers maybe just a few pages but not a lot of them um but yeah that is all the books that I picked up at Walmart for three dollars each oh and I forgot to tell you the rest of the story so yes I went to the cashier and I told her uh excuse me all these books were in the clearance section but only one is ringing up as clearance for three dollars so what you gonna do and okay i did not tell her that okay i'm sorry but i did tell her you know i explained to her that all these books were in the clearance section but only one of them was ringing for three dollars that another employee told me that i could ask you for you to fix the prices or what and then she took the books and went to ask somebody else she came back and she said, yes, ma'am, that's fine. We can give you all these books for $3 each. And I said, yay, thank you so much. And she fixed it for me. And that's how I went. I went home happy. And then a few days later, I went back to the same Walmart. I think it was three days later. I went back and I said, you know what? Maybe they have still have some books on clearance i'm gonna go check them out and i'm definitely gonna pick up more because i'm just crazy like that turns out that they changed the price in all of them but they were not three dollars anymore they were six and i was like what the hell and you know what i was thinking about buying another one of these books my favorite books the planner basics for six dollars i said six dollars is still a good deal it's still a really good deal but I said, you know what? Control yourself. You just got a bunch of them for three dollars. You cannot pay six. So I decided not to buy any. I was walking around, and I was already heading to the exit when I passed another Happy Planner clearance section. I said, what the hell? No wonder those books were somewhere else, and they were like marked wrong and everything. But I'm so happy I found this section, and it was like the whole Happy Planner stuff in clearance and I found more stuff on clearance oh my gosh so the first thing that I found was this sticky notes they were only 75 cents each well not each but the each pack I mean 
um, and it's just for the mini and I really like the sticky notes and for 75 cents why not right um, and then original price it says it's 343 I would have never bought that in full price ever but yeah that is the first thing that I found and then I saw that they had a bunch of the notebook kit <coughs> It was three fifty from fourteen eighty eight, so I said, you know what? I don't have one of these. Why not? And the reason why I never bought one of these, the Happy Notes books, is because I just mm, did not want to pay what I paid for a planner for blank pages, basically. So I just never bought one. And I never planned on buying one, honestly. I'm not so into the writing on blank pages. But I can definitely draw my own weekly pages. And then I also found the big happy notes or the classic size. And I said, oh, I already have one. I, I'm already taking one. I really don't need a big one but come on I cannot pass a clearance deal so that is everything that I found at Walmart now I'm going to show you what I recently got and I got these at Tuesday morning so I decided to go to Tuesday morning because it had been literally months since my last visit so I just had to go and dig a little and see what I can find and I did find some washi tape, these right here. So each pack was three ninety nine. I think it's a good deal because these washi tapes are cute, and they are from American Crafts. Okay, so yeah, um, I found this one, and this is like a Christmas themed um <coughs> washi tape. And I just thought they were so cute, and I love this one with the, what is this, with the Christmas lights, I just love that. And then I really like the other one on top of that, above of that, and it's just like the trucks with the Christmas tree on, on, the, on the top or whatever. And then this one with the Christmas tree, really, really cute. And then I did get some fall um, washi tips. I don't even think I have any fall washi tapes, maybe two or three that I got from like the Dollar Tree. So when I saw that they had like a whole pack, I was excited about it. It does come with a few good ones. I really like this one right here. It's um, It just has a bunch of fall leaves and it's green. And then I really like this one over here. It has Happy Fall with pumpkins. And then this one over here is like a floral, but like with fall floral, I think. Um, and then the other ones just have like a brown color with some fall related quotes in them. So yeah, I got that one. Same price, three ninety nine. And then the last one that I got was this one right here, and uh, I'm, I just I just love the colors. <coughs> It's basically for like spring. Um, it's just florals everywhere. I just thought they were so cute, and I love the colors. It has like pink. I just feel like these colors go well, so good, to, so well together. Um, so yeah, I just had to have it. Hopefully, you guys can see that. So I'm sorry, my camera is so bright. But yeah. And again, at three ninety nine, and then I went to their clearance section, and I found these adorable Christmas stickers. Just look at that. It it was one ninety nine, but it had the orange sticker, which is I think twenty percent off of original price. So I paid like one something for it. Um, <coughs> So yeah, these are so cute, I mean, they are so tiny and so adorable, I just had to get them, and let me just, and again, this is also from American Crack, and let me just open it up to show you better, 
I haven't even seen these slow screens, honestly. Hopefully you guys can see that. So that is how that first page looks. And then this is the second page. So cute and tiny, like, oh my gosh. So, so cute, honestly. So yeah, I got that from Tuesday morning. And then the last two things that I got from Tuesday morning were this book. And, oh, like, um, these books are from Hobby Lobby. I've seen them for $20, but I never bought them because I just thought they were too expensive. Even with a coupon, $12, it's still kind of a little bit expensive because they are not the Happy Planner size. They are different size. Um, I'm pretty sure you can still use them or, and fit them anywhere, but I just wanted, I just never wanted to spend something on books that are not like that are not gonna perfectly fit I guess I don't know um, but I always had this one on mind I always every time I went to Hobby Lobby I seen it and I said I need to get that I need to get that one day <coughs> and I just never did and I found it for six ninety nine at um, Hobby I mean Hobby Lobby on Tuesday morning and just look how beautiful this book is I mean it just has a bunch whoops, it just has a bunch of stickers this is like a um what's it called a um, seasonal book and I just love seasonal books like anything that has every single have holiday or season I'm obsessed with so I just had to get a look at these. Oh my god, you guys. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. These are so cute. So they kind of look a lot like the Happy Planner. Um, so hopefully they are the same size. I still don't know. I think they're going to be a little bit shorter because the, the Happy Planner did like make their boxes wi um, taller. Um, but I'm pretty sure they're going to be wide. Maybe the same size. I don't know. Um, but yeah, it has a bunch of stickers, so cute, and look at these Christmas ones, uh, adorable, look at these checklists, like, oh my gosh, and they do have some foil in them, so, yeah, but, and then I also got the Haiti Swap book that I had also been eyeing at Hobby Lobby, but I never got it for the same reason. I didn't want to spend money on a book that was different than the Happy Planners. But what the heck? It's stuck to the back. Oh, there it is. Um. So for six ninety nine, I said why not? And they had a bunch of different books, you guys. I literally was not. I had a hard time choosing. Um, I definitely knew I was going to take this one, but then when it came to this one, they had a bunch of different Haiti swap books, and I was having a hard time deciding, but at the end, I just decided to go for this one, which is very cute, and I got it, and oh, I wish I could flip through it where you can see every single page, but I'm in a hurry. Um, <coughs> oh, did you see this one? So cute florals. I love florals. So look at these. I love um, weather stickers. So if I go to today morning, I'm definitely gonna get more sticker books because look at these so cute emoji stickers. Look at this! So cute! So yeah, I'm definitely gonna buy more stickers from Tuesday morning, more sticker books from Tuesday morning. I need to go back and get more because they are, even though they are not $3 like at Walmart, they are still pretty damn good for $6.99. 
especially if you know that you can only find these books at Hobby Lobby for like twelve dollars using a coupon. So that is everything that I picked up, you guys. Hopefully, you guys watch like watching my videos. Let me know what you think if I should uh, update more often. And thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye.